According to sources close to the matter, the Duke's visa application is currently under review, which might have consequences for his family's future in the U.S. In order to obtain the Duke's visa records and more specifically, his revealed drug usage history, the Heritage Foundation has sued the Department of Homeland Security. The request was denied by the DHS, according to The Express, who cited privacy restrictions similar to those for medical records. Everyone, including the Duke, is waiting to see if Judge Carl Nichols will make the specifics of the case public, while he reviews them secretly in chambers. Royal expert Richard Fitzwilliam spoke to The Sun on the consequences, pointing out that Harry could be embarrassed. It will be extremely embarrassing, or at least it might be, according to Mr. Fitzwilliams. The Duke might have disclosed his drug usage on his application, he added. In the event that he hasn't, news of it will surely circulate, which is bad news for the Sussexes. The current visa that the Duke is on is still valid, but there may be problems with renewing it, which has led to rumors of deportation. If this were to happen, the Duke would have little choice except to leave his Montecito life, his marriage to the Duchess, their 12 million pound mansion next to an apple orchard, and their two young children, Prince Archie, five and Princess Lilibet, two. According to Mr. Fitzwilliams, who is worried about a double standard, the Duke, who has been vocal in his criticism of the royal family, may be responsible for anything that goes wrong, whether it's preferential treatment or dishonesty during his U.S. government clearance procedure. The Heritage Foundation finds this to be an important issue, he pointed out. If you attack an institution supporters of that institution, or those who believe that you've been very unwise and very foolish, believe that there are double standards. The Duke reportedly tried to prevent the disclosure of his visa application details. According to The Sun, the Heritage Foundation and others filed their lawsuit against the United States Department of Homeland Security on February 24 in Washington, D.C., and the case is still ongoing. A U.S.-based immigration lawyer named Gita Gorgi spoke exclusively to the Daily Express U.S. and said, I suspect that the judge will weigh the reasons and benefits that the Heritage Foundation argued for making the information public versus the right to the Duke's privacy and DHS's interest in keeping the information of private individuals and its matters private. If a judge grants this FOIA request, it could open up days to many future such requests in the future for less public figures, she noted. Perhaps the judge would prefer not to establish such a precedent. Here we have our video. What do you think about this? Make sure to drop a comment before you leave. Thanks for watching and see you later.